be them. All right, going back to New Orleans is very special for CP3 and head coach Monty Williams. Lena Washington found the party in the Big Easy. We picked the perfect weekend to come cover some playoff basketball. The French Quarter Festival is going on here in New Orleans. And even though the fans out here are, of course, rooting for the Pelicans, they still have love for Chris Paul and Monty Williams. I like Chris Paul, I like the rest of them. That's all I like, because he's played here before. What about Coach Monty? He all right. He was our coach, too. Got fired, but that's all right. It's always a, a special place for me um, just because of the people here. And everybody had their way of speaking to me. You know, sometimes it was, what's up, baby? And other times it was, how you doing, coach? You know, so that, that part is really cool. I know they got the French Quarter Fest going on. They got the Zurich going on. So uh, I got a lot of uh, extended family members that's here in New Orleans. We all love Chris Paul. Monty Williams is a great guy. We wish him the best, but, you know, Willie Green probably learned a lot from him, so he may have gave him a couple too many secrets that he could use against him. Like our coach Green said, we gonna win this thing. Stay focused. New Orleans is a football city, but maybe it's turned into a basketball city. It's just one of the more unique places that I've ever been to in my life. Um, when I'm in New Orleans, I feel like I'm in a different country. I think my parents, everybody will be here tomorrow for the game. Uh, my brother's wedding was here. I lived here six years, so absolutely. Yeah, always familiar here. Well, y'all have fun. Thanks for being here from Phoenix, Arizona. Welcome to New Orleans, and we hope you lose. Coming to you from New Orleans, I'm Lena Washington, 12 Sports. New Orleans is kind of like a different country. You know what? Such a fun city, though. Series all even up one apiece. Game three tips off tomorrow at 630. We'll have live pre and post game coverage right here on 12 News.